Welcome to Endo Commando 411. How are you? Today you are going to learn what it takes mentally to take your dancing to the next level. Okay? So maybe you want to dance better than you do. Maybe you don't understand why you don't look as good as another person. Okay? So today I'm going to try and help you. Okay? In three minutes or less. So we're going to do it quick. So are you ready? Put on your ready hat. I want you to think of a ballerina dancer, okay? When she moves across the floor, she is not just flailing her arms. And even if she is flailing her arms, she does it with the intent that it's going to look good to my audience, okay? So dance is about individuality, yet right? Uniqueness. It's an art form, so there isn't always a right and a wrong way to do it. And it can be interpreted in many different ways. Having said that, there is also a way to make that individuality and creativity look appealing, okay? So it's, it's an important thing. Even though it's a self expression, you also want to look good, too. So when you see that ballerina moving her arm like that, what she's doing is she's engaging her entire body. Her core is tight. Her arm starts to flex. Her arms and, and her muscles are create, are, are, have tension in them, okay? So every movement that you do, you want to add that tension. It's all about muscle tension. Does that make sense? So if you are on the floor just moving side to side, okay, and this, sorry, a little high, okay, the minute I go like that, yeah, and I add intensity, it's very different than if I'm doing this, right? How am I doing that? I'm engaging my, all my body. Okay, my legs are tightened, my core is tight, my arms are tight. Okay, so if you are moving and you're watching yourself and you're looking in the mirror, that's what you need to do. Okay, you need to look at a video, see the person that you want to look like, and then I want you to go to the mirror and do those moves in the mirror. If you don't look like that, can you? You can at least improve, right? You can improve. So the only way you imp can improve is by looking at what you want to do. So keep that focus of what you want, and then go in front of the mirror, do those moves, and I want you to do those moves practicing on tightening your body, right? So if I have a weight, and I'm going like this with the weight, and let's say it's a two-pound weight, what's the difference? Pretend I pick up a ten-pound weight. What does my body do? It's tension, right? I want you to pretend that you have that weight on your body. Go try it. You can do it. Okay? Peace out.